Hey guys, poor facts here and today we're doing a video on animation cancels and a few tips you need to know while playing the blunderbuss. All right, let's get started. All right, we're going to make this video as short as possible. We know you don't want a whole lot of the fluff, but we're going to be talking about a couple tips and a couple animation cancels. So let's get into it. First thing, we are of course talking about the blunderbuss. If you didn't know, it is a two shot, then you need to reload. Now, let's get it real quick. I think one of the most important things you're gonna do, especially for sort of this combo I'm gonna show you, is extended chamber. This is holding two loaded ammunition in for two seconds. After reload, we'll load a third active ammunition. Why do we need that, you ask? Well, because one of our most powerful abilities here is called unload. Now, we're not going to talk about trees stuff like that we're just going to give you some animation cancels and we're going to show you how to really utilize this unload passive and essentially what it means is whenever we fire a shot or an ability it's going to load three extra pellets into our weapon and if you didn't know that is absolutely crazy damage that is 50 percent if you can aim correctly 50 percent more damage on your auto attack which is bonkers you can get two of those in a row Okay, so basically, let's first start talking about the animation cancels. Now, from what I've been able to find, there are two, and they are essentially used the same way. What we can do is we can shoot an auto attack into an instant ability right after. So we're going to be using a net shot and Azoth Shrapnel Blast. Now, essentially, what we're going to do here is we're going to auto attack, and then we are going, or our basic attack, and then we're going to use both of those immediately after. It is a very timing thing. If I mess up, I am sorry. I will kind of, uh, I'll go over it again. But uh, it does take a little bit of timing, but it's not too bad. So we're just going to do a basic attack into a net shot. So watch this. All right. Now we're going to do the same with the uh, shrapnel blast. We got those both. Uh, don't mind that. That's just kind of a bug. But we got those both off really quickly. Now you can probably speed them up just a little bit. But it is... Uh, it's something that is going to be a very, very lot of burst damage. And we'll show you here again. That's a lot of burst damage, especially if you're in somebody's face. All right, we got our third shot back. All right, look at that. Really smooth. Now, the reason why this is important is because of this ability here called unload. We want to be able to actually start tailoring these abilities and start really working off. So what you can actually do is let me shoot both of these so we get our third bullet back here. So you really can't do it with the knockdown here. But we're going to so, but we're still going to do it. So if you want to do like a nice little burst combo, we're going to go into our Q. All right, now we're on them, right? We're just going to go. That is a lot of burst damage. Now, use that at what you will. There's another tip I want to show you guys. I haven't heard anybody talking about, and then this video will be over. So, if you have right-click, you can aim down the sights. That's cool, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, the one thing, if you didn't know, it actually changes the spread of your weapon. So, we have a... Uh, we're not looking back now. Just look at the bullets when they come out. They're kind of big and spread. The best thing... Let's go over here to this wall so you can actually see it a little bit better. Okay, this uh, very... This wall is actually how I was testing it. Cause I was like, is that actually doing it? And I'm like, yeah, it is. All right. Let's walk over to here. This video is already longer than I was hoping it to be. But we're going to go over to this wall so you can kind of see the spread. So we're going to shoot this wall here. You can see here the spread is pretty big. Now let's zoom in. And the spread is really tight. So you can even see it visually on the wall where the spread is comparatively to the two. So if you want to absolutely annihilate your opponent, it's going to be very imper it is going to be very important that if you want the big damage, you zoom in, you shoot them like that. But if you are just hoping to hit somebody, and you don't worry about absolutely killing them. We're not even going to zoom in. We're going to hit them like that. We still hit them with, I think, actually every bullet there. They have big targets. Boom, pop in the face. You don't have to actually aim down the sights. And then if you uh, need to be very precise, you just go boop. And we can do our little. And that is a lot of damage. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Hope you see you out there in a term. We have a bunch of New World videos coming up. You can look at them if you want. I hope you do. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I hope you enjoyed this quick down to the point video. All right. Peace.